Todd, congratulations on your first Kentucky Derby win. You said after the race it would take a couple days to really sink in. You've had a couple days now. Does it feel any different? That feels great. You know, I mean, it's uh, it's amazing when you come back home and, you know, so many people that, that normally don't follow horse racing are, are aware of it. And uh, so it's been it's been a lot of fun. And how did he come out of the race? Came out of it really well. I thought his energy level was extremely good. His appetite's been good. And, you know, you're always concerned about short rest and turning around in two weeks. But, you know, the first indications are he's, he's really doing well. Now, as far as the, going from the Derby to the Preakness, you've run relatively few horses in, in both races. Is that a, a something to do with the timing between races? Not really optimal? Yeah, pretty much. You know, with, with the two weeks, we've always felt like we're better suited to give them a little more time. Obviously, with the Derby winner, it's a different ball game, and, uh, you know, so we're excited about the opportunity. Now, you have to like the way he ran in the Derby looking forward to the Preakness. I mean, it seems like he was in a, in a good spot. He showed he could rate again. Um, how does that set up well for him for the Preakness? Well, I, th I think the, the the circumference of the track at Pimlico suit him well. He's, he runs turns well. It's a little tighter track. He's got good tactical speed, which is always good there. So I think, you know, the, the, the track suits his style pretty well. And what's his schedule going to be like leading up to the race? Well, we'll train him lightly for a few days. We'll, we'll see if we're even going to breeze him or not. If we do do something, it won't be much. But uh, his schedule is to ship from Churchill to Pimlico on Wednesday the 12th and, you know, just uh, paddock school a little bit and maybe gate school there and, and run. Got a derby down. Now uh, Preakness next? I hope so. That'd be great. All right, thanks a lot, Todd. Thank you.